I wanted to mention something very important. I have witnessed, and it happened to me a couple months ago when I was invited to visit Japan. My very first visit to a Japanese family, Muslim family, reverts who've accepted Islam. Right after I landed, they took me home and they offered me dinner. And you know how the Japanese eat very little. They're very healthy. They're not like us. But I starved there though. So I lost a lot of weight. I saw a beautiful kid whom the parents say that he insisted that he won't go to bed before meeting you. He sees you on YouTube and he wanted to meet with you. So I met him. And uh, I figured that he said he memorized two parts of the Quran. Amma and Tabarak. I said, how old are you? He said, only four years old. I looked at the parents. Neither one of them is an Arab. Neither one of them was born in Islam. Both are Japanese, reverts, and they both do not know Arabic. Not only that, I asked the father, how did you do this? Because I said, you sure? He said, yes. And I don't take things for granted. So right away, I took my iPad out and said, go ahead and recite. And I tested him. And I recorded that and I uploaded it on my page. It has the greatest likes. Four years old, Japanese kid, very nice looking, mashallah. Reciting in a very beautiful, melodious voice. I asked him, how did he achieve that? He said, online, my wife listens and she repeats to him and they both memorize. While many of us who were born in Islam do not know how to read a verse of the Quran. It's just a matter of making an effort. And again, it was the mother. Now she says, mashallah, she has a tutor, a lady from Oman or whoever, who reads before her and corrects her recitation on Skype. If there is a will, there is a way. And this is how she achieved that. They're learning in Japan or in China or in Russia. 